Hey guys, Sam Move You here. I'm watching Dark Fluff. This is uploaded November 3rd, 2020. Mother in law pierced my baby's ears without my permission. I'm furious. Okay. Yes, piercing baby's ears is odd, but the baby was only five months old. I'll repeat that. Their granddaughter was five months old. And her grandmother, the husband's mother, went and got the baby's ears pierced. Did not involve the mother, did not ask the mother or father for her permission. I mean, for, I'm sorry, I'm so mad I can't speak. For permission, she just went and did it anyway and said, Oh, do you see anything different with baby? And she thought, oh, well, maybe she got clothes or something. But no, she got her ears pierced. She didn't know, you know, what they used. Anything like that. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just extremely, extremely angry. And they were together for five years before they got married. Okay. Um, that's a lot to unpack. Uh, as an aunt of three, and I only see one, but that's not the point. Um, I think of my second niece as my own child. She's in school. But I would never ever go behind my family's back and get a baby's ears pierced at such a young age. That's just ridiculous. And I hope they go low or no contact with this crazy woman. Because, good lord, with all the stories you hear of just no mother-in-law on Reddit, one kidnapped a baby to go have a test. This is a different story, I'm sorry. I'm so mad. Had a got went to go get a DNA test done, and they, and the people did the right thing, called the cops because they want she wanted to know if it was her son's baby. Woman, that's what shows like Mori Mo, Mo, Povich is for, and other stuff like that. I just don't understand these entitled women that have kids and become entitled mothers and grandmothers and mother-in-laws. I, I, I truly, truly don't. I, I, it's dangerous, it's toxic, and it makes me just so angry. Sorry this was long and ranty. I'll talk to y'all later. Sarah moved you out.